the Comet was the world's first jet turbo powered engine. But British pride soon turned to horror when two de Havilland jets crashed within months of each other. The ships of the Royal Navy hastened to the spot, but there were no survivors. An extensive investigation showed that the accident was a result of metal fatigue caused by the repeated pressurization of the cabin. This information was shared with de Havilland's rivals at Boeing, and a key lesson was learned. In aviation, lessons are learned all the time. Each aircraft is equipped with two indestructible black boxes which record vital information. If there is an accident, the boxes are excavated, the data analysed and the system, crucially, is adapted. And that means the same mistakes don't happen again and it's had astonishing results. Last year, the accident rate for major airlines was one crash for every 8.3 million takeoffs. But compare this with healthcare, where clinicians often spin and conceal mistakes because of the fear of litigation and the threat to reputation. The consequence is simple. The same mistakes are repeated. And that's why preventable medical error is one of the biggest killers in the UK. It kills way more people than traffic accidents. Failure is inevitable in a complex world. Politicians, businessmen, even scientists are going to get things wrong. But what are we going to do with these mistakes? Do we spin them? Do we shun them? Or do we harness them as precious learning opportunities? After all, if we don't know where we're going wrong, how can we ever put things right?